I think that teachers, science teachers, should be paid a little bit different. You know, uh, there should be a difference in the, te the, the emoluments for a science as against a teacher who teaches social studies or geography or something like that. Mm -hmm. I know that is controversial where the JTA is, is con concerned, but mm -hmm. we have to go that route, mm -hmm. you know, to keep the best of the best. I remember asking Minister Thwaites what they could do about the schools for and the children to do, to reset math or to do maths as part of the school's program, even though they already had it in um, privately. I think that is a little bit regrettable because in the States, they facilitate um, situations like these. You know, as long as you're competent and you're not being pressured, because none of my students are being pressured. I said, what, you should just go in there and do your best, you know? And that's what we have required of them. You think that teachers of all subjects, for example, that they can use their body language to discipline children rather than having to be shouting after them or getting definitely, into fights and so? so. I'm against corporal punishment. I'm against ridiculing a student. You can find more ways, you know, more um, decent ways to discipline your child, you know? The way how you write comments, you know, you, you shouldn't just praise... You mean on the children's yes, reports? Yes, mm -hmm. uh, in their book, you shouldn't just praise the final effort, you know, the final output, but, you know, talk about the effort that is placed in, so that even if a child gets it wrong, it's not the final thing you're looking at, you're looking at the effort that the child places in, into the activity, you know? Mm -hmm. So, so the way you, you distribute rewards and punishment is very crucial in motivating the child to achieve their best. Right. So those comments motivate as well as demotivate. And another way, we use grading, you know, as a means to discriminate and not in the positive way, you know. We should use grading in such a way, you know, you should like giving multiple opportunities to improve on your grade. That's a technique that works very well in the States. You have to submit an assignment. It's not the greatest possible grade you got the first time around, but you give the student an opportunity, a second opportunity, to do well and to improve on their grades. Okay. So if you're giving a math test, you could do a change of question, but uh, test the same concepts and, you know, and give that child an opportunity to improve. So what you're teaching that child is that what? The final result shouldn't be that, that thing that characterizes you, you know, but what? The progress over time is what best, you know, tells the true picture. I fall in the trap of giving back. This is what I'm doing on my veranda. I've always said that I wanted to give back. Mm -hmm. And if I had it more, I would give back on a bigger scale. Mm -hmm. Because there are students coming here, I pay for the subject, I pay for material, I do a lot of that for, as support. Mm -hmm. Just to see them blossom, you know? Mm -hmm. For the young girls and the, and the young boys here who are wasting their time, what, what, what would you What would I say? Yeah. I, as I said before, education is paramount. Especially when you, you come from a, a generation that didn't have any generational wealth to pass on to you. This is one way out of poverty, mm -hmm. right? Making use of your educational opportunities, showing respect for each other, you know, that emotional intelligence is very important. Because if a student is very respectful to me and he's slow, I'll go the mile with him because of that level of respect that he shows for me, you know? And then when he see that you care that much, or she see that you care that much, They'll put in more effort in their work and sometimes they, 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 they surprise you okay. in, their, in their achievements. Okay. I'm very, very competent in physics and electronics. I used to lecture electronics at Excel, but because the demand for the program went down because, you know, there were a lot of cable companies at the time. But, but when, it, when it come under one umbrella with, um, you know, the, okay. the big company there, yeah. a lot of them were sold out. So that, that kind of market kind of drive up for the, the small technicians and so. So we used to train technicians at um, Excel, mm -hmm. you know, electronics and stuff like that. And I'm very good at physics and, and disappointingly though a lot of students are turning away from it. And that's disappointing mm -hmm. just because physics, maths and the sciences, that's our ticket out of poverty and for transforming Jamaica into, you know, a, from a third world to probably second or first world. Mm -hmm. You know, talking about training, you know that we train a couple but you know that many of them migrate. Because when I went to the interview to go abroad, I was in a room with practically about 1,200 persons, and they are looking for the best of the best. And fortunately, I was, I was selected, right? And I know that- That, just, that just went? That was what, a couple years ago was 2020, 20, 2010? 2010, 20, yeah. Something like that. So you were selected as- as one, one of the students to teach, one of the, one one of the teachers, teachers to, to teach in, um, in, in um, 
in Los Angeles. Yes. And, you know, I think that if we do a lot more for our students, student teachers, mm -hmm. then they will reciprocate and they'll stay. But we have to make the condition a little bit better. I think that teachers, science teachers, should be paid a little bit different. You know, uh, there should be a difference in the, te the, the emoluments for a science as against a teacher who teaches social studies or geography or something like that. Mm -hmm. I know that is controversial where the JTA is, is con concerned, but we have to go that route, mm -hmm. you know, to keep the best of the best.